you know we had to stand six feet away in COVID, but you have to stand eight feet or 25 feet or 100 feet in Westchester County, New York. They're more afraid of pro-life speech for which 73 million people a year die around the world and 1.2 million not even listed as a cause of death. They're more afraid of that than they are of COVID. And so we but are why suing. why would they do it? Buffer zones lose. Nine times they've lost. Was it eight of them unanimously? Liberal justices and conservative justices? All but, all but well, Hill v. Colorado. Yeah. Ginsburg called them un-American. Mm-hmm. Are they picking on 40 days for life? Or yes. They, okay. Yeah. The fact of the matter is, is that if, if you go to the Westchester County, um, they call them Board of Legislators, uh, Board of Supervisors, you know, you might call them a town council or a city council, but, uh, and you can read the legislative history, and that's what they're talking about. They're, talk, they're, they're picking on rescue uh, pe- people that sit ins and us. And if you go to Bournemouth, wherever that is, England, in the UK, yes. I know where it is, you know where it yeah. is, but we had to learn it. It's all 40 days for life. So right. there's people in it, which is good. That's where they outlawed making the sign of the cross. How Henry the Eighth of them, by the way, but but it's a loser legally. We're going to win this. We're going to sue. It'll go to the I, Supreme Court. Could this end buffer zones for good, like once yes. for all? So when you say this, you mean Westchester County? Yeah, Westchester. Just to be clear, yes, Westchester County is a very wealthy county and just north of New York City in New York, and they stupidly, in my opinion, or maybe expertly. Uh, have given us the opportunity to end the only buffer zone that the Supreme Court of the United States said that the Constitution allows that I know of, which is Colorado v. Hill, which is eight feet, if you can imagine this. Like, who makes this stuff up? It's just like when Black men, uh, made up the trimester, which nobody argued. Yeah, yeah, Black okay. men, yeah. So, so, so there's eight feet, apparently, around a, a, an abortion-minded woman where you can't talk about the pro-life. It's like a bubble. Yeah, but if you went up and said, "Do you want to try my uh, pork ribs?" Yeah, or do you like lemonade? Yeah, yeah you, you like would lemonade. You, would you do, would you donate to Greenpeace? So it's specifically your opinion, not on abortion, but the fact that you're against abortion. Even though McCullen v. Coakley, the Supreme Court said, it, it's absurd to think you can ask someone the weather or the time, but not debate the most important issues of our time in a public forum. Anyway, but they added. Oh, and 25 feet for some stuff. Oh, and 100 feet for other stuff. And it's not just 100 feet you can't approach an abortion-minded woman. It's 100 feet from the premises. And who knows what that means. What is that? And that, so that's, now it's not, doesn't even have to be owned by them. It's like the sidewalk, the exit. The, the neighborhood. Un- so what they're doing is they're ending face-to-face contacts because they know it works. And we have provided the impact that it is going to have on us. But you should know at home, we're, we're not in the business of getting lawsuits for the sake of lawsuits. We've actually been very blessed to avoid them, and you've kept us the out first of The first time that you and the board have allowed it. Yeah, and, and we're doing it because we're going to protect our rights, we're going to protect you, and it's absurd. We live in a free country. Your opinion uh, should matter in the public square, and we've won. We won in Nottingham. <laughs> Uh, England, where uh, Robin Hood is from. We won in Liverpool, where they arrested a 76-year-old grandmother for praying the rosary. Uh, We won those. So when we challenge it, we win. I think we're going to win in New York. Um, We will win in New York. The best case scenario they have is to remain in place that eight-foot buffer zone. Because they've also made it criminal. Criminal. It's a crime. You get locked up. And by the way, the lady in Liverpool, the grandma with the rosary, got locked up. Rosa. Rosa. And also... um, they have huge debilitating civil penalties. And just to be very clear, we are suing the, the county of New York called Westchester, the police and the public safety because they have the ability to enforce this. And it isn't a zone of silence, guys. It's a zone of no pro-life. No pro-life. That's what makes it they, so un It's not that no one can talk, it's that you can't talk.